I think he found here a pleasant way to live, a good way to live for him. He stayed here nine years, uh, which was the longest time he ever stayed anywhere uh, as an adult, and left only when uh, it became, the Civil War became imminent, and he wanted then to be a part of the war. During the Civil War, General Joseph Hooker was the commander of the Army of the Potomac until he was defeated by Confederate forces under Robert E. Lee at Chancellorsville in 1863. But before that, he lived in Sonoma and built this house, now a little museum dedicated to his history and his love for Sonoma and its land and its relaxed way of life. I think probably one of the things he liked was the Blue Wing Hotel over here, the uh, rather free lifestyle. Hooker wasn't alone, of course. General William Tecumseh Sherman liked the Blue Wing, too, as did General Vallejo, and later General and President U.S. Grant. What is a soldier going to do if there's no war? <laughs> Play cards, drink. <laughs> and go to the Blue Wing Inn. <laughs> At the Blue Wing Inn, yeah. <laughs> lucky to have it. <laughs> and we're lucky to have the Blue Wing ourselves and the Hooker House, both cared for and interpreted by Sonomans with a sense of history and a sense of humor. <laughs> he wasn't alone. No, no. 